Hello Aquarius, welcome to your reading. If the calling is going to be, I'm going to provide the time or month or week or something. But these are timeless, so as per your timelines. Hopefully that you all are doing well. Sending you love all the way from India, Bharat, Namaste. Uh, hope for the best. Let's hope for the best, okay? Um, also, I am on Instagram, running. Thank you for being like an eternal part of my journey throughout these years, throughout the time frame when you have hit the like button. So to tell me your presence in order to let me know that how you people are doing, whenever I've asked, you people still continue to comment, but you then also comment. So thank you for that, letting me know that you all are well. I haven't heard from many people uh, in the comment section because that is the only way to know plus I re you know leave the comment section open is the reason that I want to really know about you all that like I do get emotional okay to be honest I won't hide so uh, yes I really would love to know about you all that you all are fine uh, in case you people are not doing okay so people support each other I try to leave the heart okay some messages, some comments are very uh, emotional, you know, heartbreaking. So I don't know what to do about that. How can I like that? Because my heart is saying to send you the healing and all. I know I'm taking your time, but I just want to talk at times in the mid of my readings. And today I'm not going to forget the message because it's right on my lips, like here. And I know that something is very strong that is going to be getting into the bond i can sense it like in your life you're going to feel really strong just like strength card you're going to feel like the roar of a lion or a roar of you know the tiger sort of energy wherein you people are going to embark on something beautiful in your life now and it is coming with a lot of like you're coming out of like a lot of disappointment uh, in your time frames as per your time frames okay so thank you for all that you do in all the forms that you do okay thank you for being here so let's start I was shuffling the deck this is not a flip but this was in a twisted like sort of like slipping out from the bottom and so I thought like keeping it here okay so we're going to just start with the message so I've I can see here that an old book, okay, A-N-N-O-L-D-B-O-O-K, -O -O -K, an old book will speak. Just like in some animated movies or just like in sort of like a Harry Potter kind of, like a book, book is speaking or, or something else. Like this is an old book. So it feels like it's an old connection for some of you, okay, or just an old book is speaking. The pages were like speaking from the mid, not the binding uh, part, okay? But the, not the hard part, but the mid part of the papers and pages, all those are collected in accumulation. They are speaking, they're speaking something. So an old book shall speak. This can open in your life in any form, but it's very interesting that something is going to happen. now this is interesting why is because your card is also six of cups in this deck it is six of chalices so again uh, it's very interesting okay let's see together I said so that you're going to be happy about something okay okay fine you're going to be very happy about something here maybe you're about to meet you're going to talk to someone now yes this may be romantic this may be something new this may be the old connection but this is someone for certain percentage of here for you guys this is someone who who is very close to you a very warm connection but possible there was something that happened that that gave you that energy of like a a cut like there's a satin ribbon you do the inauguration and you never realize that there is like something that's like cutting and this was the bond okay it's not you did they did it just it just happened whoever did or whatever happened something happened that was the reason of this silky satin connection that happened like tick 
like with the scissors I mean to say I hope it makes sense here okay so this is six of chalices like there is going to be a sense of freedom this is going to be like an inner child living again kind of energy or something that you never were able to kind of do you're going to do it re-energizing yes like it's something that you're going to have a childhood memory come back to you something that you're going to find again you used to enjoy in childhood this could be even some edible thing i know it's very tiny talk <laughs> uh, a tiny memory but it is important for the person who went through that right it's very important we feel like all all of a sudden nostalgic like just sitting on the roof and then you are again living that kind of energy um, or something that you saw way back on the um, on the shop and you now seeing that and again you are like oh like uh, you found it okay somebody will find you you will find them you will find them and then this energy is like just goes with the song like finally found you yes i can like i know that i have this message but still it connects with like finally found you kind of energy you're going to be happy like the this is the phase this is the connection whether it's resurging whether it's someone coming in this lifetime for you for the first time this is something where you are comfortable this is somewhere where you can talk like infinite you know whatever you want to talk you can talk no one gonna judge okay like you can talk shit like anything that you have you can like just let out or pour out all your burdens and everything and then you feel like a baby like you feel like a here like a child energy okay so i can sense here very strong that people over here whoever are going to live this energy they are going to be cherishing this moment for life to come like for a long long time to come like being together memorizing it like whatever that is for you guys okay so it's very beautiful actually and i'm very happy that you people are going to live this it feels I can feel like this is this is not in the card. It's right here in front of me, like you know. Your person in your memory or the person from your past, I feel like you know them. Uh, so this can be any kind of phase of your life. But let's see. You have King of Chalices, which is a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. this person stood strong in their own life in their own struggles in their own emotional complexities or emotional phases this person connects with your an old book vintage book this old book will speak like from the mid there is going to be some page that's going to do this like flip 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 and then it feels though the message is coming from that person or this person is researching reconnecting or possible try of course to connect with you now it depends what you do but i feel very strong that they're going to speak something okay sometimes i feel in my readings that i have so much to write in the title but i have to like have the limit of course okay because like it's going to be then again not the title but the story <laughs> so you need to listen to my reading and i hope that you enjoy it um I really feel connected with you people and it's not fake it's it's something like I really feel and I am the person who's going to if I'm being triggered I'm going to tell that if I I feel loved I'm going to tell that I I just love talking and I just love reading cards and I really feel that like like right now this is my purpose of life <laughs> like they chose me it's so I have to okay and I am going to do it so let's see so there's this person okay uh they've been becoming something in their life it is about this person okay so they've been becoming now this card is just not about the person this is about your own life as well like this is how well you grew okay and where you are now what you are doing so 
I'm having hiccups. I know you're missing me. I know whoever is like, you, you know, feels they feel connected with me. Mm. Yes, they're missing me. So connect via Instagram because I'm only there. And again, email and this channel. So let me see what is there. Mm -hmm. uh, they're thinking about an old offer. Uh, mm, yes, look, the moment that I'm, I'm cutting the deck again, even it's zero the full energy. Someone is waiting to come out of that book or the shadows and then they, they are uh, thinking of coming out and then saying something that they feel was the good opportunity or they are still holding that offer they haven't done anything about it and it is for you but they have cobwebs now that's why it's connected with the past okay this person still feels the connection i mean they still feel possible they 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 not they're not in the i'm sorry <laughs> they're not in the zone of totally let go kind of which is like again in the memory flashback they still hold feelings they still have that energy of like uh we cannot i cannot let go okay sort of now even if you people are far away the emperor energy is here there may be an aries this person okay they have achieved a lot and if you are just talking about that person now for you you have a good hold baby yeah, to be honest i was like in the like way back i was like um i have mentioned this many times like once or twice i suppose that when people used to like call me not uh, the male energies definitely I, I am honest okay there used to be like hi baby and I was like not comfortable look I am from India so I have many hard rules <laughs> personally I used to have okay but now I'm like a little chill with these things okay because I know that what is the intention behind it right so someone is calling me with in a loving manner baby so this could be anything, not just romantic or something. As someone who is going to be interested totally, they are going to tell me exactly, right? So, yes, now I call darlings, I call everyone, you know, I send my love because love is different for different people. There's so affection from my side for you guys. People love me with love, love. People love me with, so, uh, like I have grown in, like in that way. Um, no, it's okay, we can, you know. So it's not a big deal because I was in school then uh, or high school, you know, high school or in college where maybe, no, don't call me that. I'm not a baby. I, I used to say like, you know, I'm not a baby. Like even then I used to, then I slowly and steadily understood, okay, this person is my friend. Okay. And I had good friendships. Like I, like you can say that I was friend of all who was my, I don't know, <laughs> I used to talk. Uh, with everyone it was like a good cordial relations okay yeah I'm that kind of energy so I don't like choose like this this will be my friend because they have something I don't do I don't go for that okay okay fine so now I'm fine with that but no random cannot call me baby the people need to have some connection with me a little bit only then they can call a random person coming like hey babe no i'm not your babe <laughs> i'm not i'll be only one person's babe or baby okay in that case i'm a baby of my mama my mummy and papa that's it so uh, just talks in meds so to make things like little bit if you like it just let me know because some people like some don't like but i'm going to do it anyways All right, so they have something for you. Okay, yeah, okay. So an old book will speak. Again, for some of you, you might be the father or you might be in a long time relationship. You could be mother as well. Okay, goes vice versa. So you have a family here. You have children. 
and you just hold them very close and you cherish their memories so it's about the growing season it's about moving it's about learning it's about everything nice about the process of a family and of bringing your children so now for some of you this could be the energy uh, you might be in the phase some who are welcoming someone in your life new birth could be here which is very interesting okay now let's see an old book shall speak an old book shall speak so there is definitely ace of chalices coming your way and it's going to be very profound it's going to be very beautiful just like this card this could be someone who still thinks of you in a good way in a positive way dreams about you there's okay there are dreams i can see and the the dream realm is totally different everyone is aware about it some people remember the dream some don't i feel like in the time frame people are connecting via dreams as well or certain messages being delivered via dream and just we when we open the eyes and the dream is gone we sometimes remember only a small part so maybe it's just the message that's it and it's going to like end kind of okay so there is love coming uh for some it's going to be after a big pause okay so chalices an old book shall speak what is speak about in the future knight of chalices but let's see you have five of pentacles and that's why i said that an old book shall speak people are ready to confide now but this was some lost opportunity but i feel like five of pentacles is someone who is trying to catch up with you because they miss you also but also this is someone who connects with old an old book you also have like look at this the position You see this? Like someone is going to come from here. <laughs> it's like the den. It's like, wow! It's so interesting, right? And here you have the death card. Okay. And I saw. You know what I saw? I saw brain. Brain. Someone is thinking about you. I saw brain. Okay. Someone is saying, please don't get offended. It's just coming as in like. Use your brain. Okay. That's how it is coming. which means like think more take it in a positive way okay think more about something that you have already dealt and what decision should be made take that in a positive way okay because you know words are like oh how come you use your brain we are using our brain i know we all are but when we are emotionally connected or when we do so much of stuff or when someone we're just thinking about that and we are just losing us out and just thinking about something or we want it but it is draining us then we are like we are going to ignore some things that's what i mean to say okay and i my people will understand look at the situation here i'm saying so this is the death card though scorpionic wife this is something that ended this this caterpillar is crawling back to you or oh, this caterpillar is coming back or is coming towards you why they want possible transition look at this card okay you have three of swords it's it was over it's over a disappointing phase possible recurring or this is something decision making three of swords is is a separation is something that is connected with a heartache okay someone who broke your heart or disappointed you possible this offer is coming from that place possible again uh, because an old book speaks right and you have all the choices here like if you don't want that an old book to speak you're going to close it and keep it keep on the shelf right and you're going to decide for your betterment that's why maybe that message came through and that's why i said don't don't get offended it's just a it just the words and they come in a different way so we need to decode it why they're saying that right so yes there's this situation of three of swords and i 
this someone whoever is feels pulled towards you they feel that they did wrong and of course i feel like someone is uh, regretting something i feel very strong that they are regretting it if this is about an old connection okay from your past they are regretting that they disappointed you now they might be overthinking here we're going to take it okay um and you been in the process of cutting the ties not to think and yet that you have done almost but let's see hmm we need to stop here i'm going to so you have the star card you are in your future which means aquarius card of course the star but there is a destiny meeting there is a destiny call the call means call call could be but the call is destiny will align both of your energies an old book shall speak what you're going to do about it love offer from someone who is been who been overthinking and they are regretting and they are going to confess it that i did wrong and i'm thirsty without you which means that my life is sort of like soulless without you okay because you also have two of chalices two of cups someone who wants to break like they want to talk everything about in the now to let you know that i want to remove that shadow from the moon or something like that and then i want to reunite and i want to promise you that is the calling of like they have a lot to talk about um will that or would that would that touch going to feel the same and i don't mean exactly physical physical i mean feel like like the vibe vibe that does go with the little bit of touch or hint of a finger kind of or is there any spark left is there any spark left <laughs> ha ha and no book shall speak and no uh, this person feels that oh someone wants to return to you and that's why it's a oh eight of cups reversed emotional uh pull yes but staying away to be honest one you you don't want to allow that for variety of reasons of course but this is someone who wants to come to you they want to look at this they want to they want to tell you they want to return and tell you that i i love you but uh, this is very weird why because why you want to come back like you did what you did right look at this again six of uh, cups someone who wants to renovate what they did wrong like they are regretting they are they are and they want to return back and undo but how can they do the undo of something that they have already done it's a big thing right and i cannot change the message i don't want to because i want to stick with that message because an old book shall speak so in the middle of the pages the story that you have written on long gone or back burner someone is uh, interested in like you know contacting you page of cups now we can take it as something new also why because something that you are denying you are saying no oh my god i felt something was there on my camera like from here something came and gone i mean i don't know maybe it's just a <laughs> something something will be happening in your life darlings oh so fast okay you are going to be you are going to say no to somebody i don't want to say anything else uh and yes things are going to change energy is going to shift and then maybe something else will be written in the future what you do but i feel you're going to say no you're going to decline someone the one who did 
who who was who who was unjust like what's that they did not do <laughs> my english is going uh, okay sorry someone who was unjust someone who was not right in treating you someone who disappointed you emotionally hurt you did the you know i just wonder i don't feel the way and feel the way oh. okay bye okay but the problem is that yes we are going to get hurt in the process we do but look at this this is coming from someone who is missing you and maybe they are coming out of some going through heartache possible they're going to reveal that to you uh and this definitely goes with the message that i saw like an old book shall speak someone who disappointed you did hurt you three of uh, swords energy is sort of like your decision like you're going to say no i don't want to claim it or i don't have feelings for you so clear and i have now the message that i want to ask and then what is going to happen if you say no of course there are so many i'm sorry if you're going to say no and that i see and that you should there may be an aries leo sagittarius possible or falling in chart if you say no judgment shall be served first of all you have judgment card but the hidden card behind it is five of cups while saying no you're going to feel a uh, little bit but you shouldn't but you're going to feel it because those are emotions emotions are talking okay but yes so practically you're going to say no and you're not going to show your emotions even if you feel a little bit you know judgment mm -hmm. in this time frame when you're going to say no judgment shall be served and then someone is going to feel five of cups and this is like karma this is someone who is going to feel the way you felt but they are going to emotionally call you back judgment is my call back someone is going to call you back someone is going to call you back and this person is missing you they are going to that's what is going to happen this is a good oh my god so many this is a um, good tarot how <laughs> are oh, going to be good okay someone is going to call you please give me one card please this could be king of air gemini libra aquarius but your card is this which is two of water they have golden fishes crossing each other's life this is reunion and you have two of cups here as well someone is going to follow you either follow you back and this may go as in like social apps as well but someone is going to follow you back even if you are crossing paths and you say no this person is going to follow you like they're going to try again king of air someone is all eyes on you focused on you they're going to see what what's going to happen in the future this may be your own energy but i feel that there could be a masculine energy as well possible listening dealing but again if you are a feminine interested in masculine or someone who is like that or was around you like that i feel this two of water weird things happen okay i feel like two of cups is like they are going to follow like it's it's like yes finding finding each other finding you take care see you soon bye bye